Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Your back actress Abiola Adebayo had earlier confessed early this year that she would rather be single than being in a wrong marriage. Well, it is alleged that Biola Adebayo is now preparing to get married to a London-based businessman who is doing quite well for himself. This job actress and producer Abiola Adebayo, who is also popularly known as Biola in your car, has said that she is actually not desperate for marriage. And Biola says that though the society expects a woman of marriageable age to settle down and have kids in due time, she would rather remain single and happy than end up in a messy marriage. This was what she revealed early this year. She then told Sunday Scoop that, to be honest with you, I don't know when I would be getting married. I'm not desperate about marriage. If not for the pressure that comes from society and expectations from the church, left to me. If it comes, it's fine. And if not, it's okay. I want that. I just want to be happy. I want to have a good relationship with people around me and with God. That's all that matters. I wish to have everything my peers have, but I would rather not be married than be in the wrong marriage. I'm not going to be pressurized. I told people around me that I'll get married at the right time. So we think this is the right time for Biola Adebayo based on this news. And she also added that some people think that I have a high taste when it comes to men. But I told them that my kind of woman doesn't come easily. I'm virtuous and I'm not an everyday woman. So I'm not ready to marry an everyday man either. For clarity's sake, I'm not looking for a perfect man or a very rich man. I just want a man that has rare qualities like I have. Will come, but if he doesn't come, life continues. I've seen many people in unhappy marriages who will do anything to leave those troubled juniors. I don't want to find myself in such situations, she said. Well, congratulations to Biola Adebayo on this lovely news as she said to marry a London-based businessman fiance. Meanwhile, in another news, Biola Adebayo had this to say about spirituality and how it does not clash with the rules she had in movies. Biola Nyoka says that she did not grow up in the church but then she chose to be a Christian because she wanted to. In her words, I won't play all rules but I can play many rules. There are some things that I would know to do as a Christian and African woman. Though our movies are circulated around the world, our target audience has an African orientation. A director can't tell me to do a new drill and I did happily do it. No, I wouldn't. There are some type of clothes that I can't even wear. Although I want to be seen as a versatile actor that can do all things, but nothing that abuses my person as a woman. Also, Biola Adebayo is among the celebrities that speak boldly against living fake life. She described the society as unfairly putting so much pressure on celebrities. And according to this beautiful dark-skinned actress, the society is fond of setting unrealistic standards for celebrities. In an interview with Saturday Beats, Bella Adebayo noted that she would not be pushed to steal or do illegal deals to live a fake life. This was what she reviewed. When I started my acting career and became famous, there were so many responsibilities for me and I couldn't beat up. People started seeing me as a celebrity and at that time, I didn't even have the material things to qualify as a celebrity. At some point, I had to ask myself if I really wanted to go into the movie industry fully. Bearing in mind that I had other things I was doing alongside. The society sets a standard for you the moment you become a celebrity. After Yoka, the movie that made me famous in 2004, I found it difficult to take public buses. I didn't even have the money to buy a car at the time, so it hit me hard. I even had demands for family members and some of my neighbors. They assume they have so much money. The pressure the society puts on celebrity is too much. I cannot fake what I am not. I bless God because I am not where I used to be. But I am not where I am going yet. I have responsibilities too. And it's not like I earn as much as people think I do. But I am not poor. Some celebrities do what they are not supposed to do. To make ends meet because of the high expectations of the society. Sometimes I am on the red carpet. They always ask me, what I'm wearing. I know they expect me to call the big designers, but in my mind, I always tell myself that I can't steal to buy all these big brands. Sometimes when they ask me those questions, I don't even answer them. Even when they ask me who designed my dress, I simply tell them it is a tailor. Even some politicians still, just to meet up with the expectations of the people. This is what she said. Also, a few years ago, some fans thought Bill Adipay left the movie scene for something else, owing to her rare appearances in movies. She however noted that she never left the movie scene at any point. According to her, what makes it appear so was because she was more involved in movie productions than before. This was what she said then. A lot of people thought I had left the movie scene at a time, but 
I think it is because I do more jobs now than I used to. At some point, because of my studies, I couldn't fully focus on my acting career. When I chose to become an actor, my parents were a bit skeptical because they felt it was too demanding and not profitable. I lost my dad the year I started acting. I grew up in an environment where I had to struggle my own to make it. My family members didn't believe I could act because of my shy nature. I like challenging roles. I don't like roles that portray me as a, as a quiet person. I prefer roles that make me put in extra effort. Griela Dubai also noted that she likes baby mama roles and roles that make her act rude and arrogant because these are different from her own nature and she talked about her secret to her ageless shape adding that her dress size has not changed for over 20 years now and she said that the secret of my beautiful physique is the fact that i eat healthy and i don't eat junk food sometimes i get advances from men who are younger than me but i handle them with wisdom some of them would say there is no big deal in dating younger men but I don't believe in dating someone younger than me. I don't embarrass them. I'm happy with the fact that I'm appreciated. Above all, I feel it is the proof of God's grace on my life. In the last 20 years, I have not changed the size of my dress, she said. Also, Biela Adiba, even though she's a celebrity, she's an introvert. And she revealed a while ago that it's so difficult to change your person. Sometimes I try to mingle, but I don't feel too comfortable. I just love my home. I love being my own world. I enjoy it better because I have time to reflect and think about my life. I have time to do things and stay with my family, but I just realized I still have friends, but the only thing is that I don't want to say I'm not good at keeping friends. Every of my close friends try to be with me. I'm not good at calling, visiting friends. But anytime I see my friends, I like to talk to them, share their problems and all. That is what I do to meet up with friends. I don't go asking for them all the time. They come asking for me and I really appreciate it. Most times, things that I cannot do, when I find people doing it, I tend to appreciate them better. I'm not the type that makes friends here and there because I'm not everywhere at every time. And so many people do not know this, but Bella Inyoka, Bella Ribayo, actually does not like that her name, Bella Inyoka. Even though it is the name that brought her fame and opened doors for her, but really, when people call her by that name, she feels bad. She prefers people calling her Abiola Bashon or Abiola Adebayo. However, so many people do not even know her real name. They rather call her Abiola in your car. Well, for Abiola Adebayo, she feels that her real name, Abiola Adebayo, is more beautiful than the name Biola in your car. We have come to the end of this episode and we're saying congratulations to Biola Adibayo on this wonderful news. You hope you enjoyed this episode and like to know two new things, subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.